Today we're going to learn a few vocabulary words about parabolas. All right, so the first thing is concave up or down. Concave up means it's going to open like a U. Concave down means it's going to be flipped and it's going to be opening the other way. So kind of remember that up, it's going to be shaped like a U. Down, upside down U. All right, vertex is the very tip of the U, whether or not it's right side up or upside down. So right here, this yellow dot is the vertex. The coordinates of that are 2, negative 8, because from the origin, which is where the x-axis and the y-axis intersect, you would go over 2, hop on the elevator, and go down to negative 8. Axis of symmetry is the line of symmetry. So where this pink dotted line is, you have the same thing on both sides. So the vertex is along that line. These two points right here, they're each two away from the mirror. And these green points here, they're each four away from the mirror on both sides. So it's the line of symmetry. And then again, why it's x equals two. Um, if I were to take any point along this um, axis, let's say I did this one right here where the mouse is at, the coordinates of that point is 2, 0. So the x value is 2, the y value is 0. If I were to take this point right up here at 2, 2, again, the x value is 2. If I were to go down here where the vertex is at, that is 2, negative 8. So no matter where I go along this axis, the y, or sorry, the x coordinate is always 2. So it's always a straight line up and down. If it said um, y equals 2, that would be a line um, flat like this. All right, y-intercept is where the parabola crosses the y-axis. So for this one, along the y-axis, this blue point is where the parabola crosses the y-axis. So that's our y-intercept. It's down here at negative 6, and the coordinates of that point would be 0, negative 6. Then we also have x-intercepts. So if the parabola crosses the x-axis, each time it does, those points are called the x-intercepts. So we have one here at negative 2, and over here at positive 6, and these are the coordinates. So in today's assignment, you are going to practice identifying if these are concave up or down and identify the specific points and the axis of symmetry. Good luck.